Dead to Me's final season included a significant character death that shocked many viewers. But did that person truly pass away? In the wake of the Netflix show's final episodes, there has been a lot of discussion regarding this character's demise. Here are reactions from viewers to the season 3 finale of Dead to Me, as well as what the actor has to say about the character's arc coming to a conclusion. In the final season of Dead to Me, Judy Hale is diagnosed with cervical cancer. The themes of loss and friendship are central to the show. Jen Harding, Christina Applegate, meets Judy Hale, Linda Cardellini, in a grief support group after her husband is killed in a hit-and-run accident. Soon enough, Jen learns Judy and her ex-husband Steve, James Marsden, are the ones behind the accident. In a twisted web of fate and lies, the two become best friends who are willing to do whatever it takes to protect their friendship. Dead of Me's last season features Judy receiving a stage 4 cervical cancer diagnosis, but she chooses not to tell Jen. Nothing would make Jen happier than to give back to Judy for the love and joy she provided into her life in the strangest of ways. Judy vows to rely on Jen for her chemotherapy treatments, and, if all else fails, the final days of her life when her illness turns terminal after concealing it for as long as she could. In the third season of Dead to Me, does Judy pass away? Dead to Me's last episode features Jen and Judy making their getaway to Mexico. Instead of enrolling in a research experiment, the group hides out at Steve's cabin, where Judy consumes alcohol, uses marijuana, and talks about the past with a pregnant Jen. We've reached the end ends with Jen discovering a message from Judy and her footprints in the beach, which directs Jen's attention to an abandoned rowboat drifting in the water. Reddit users have expressed their opinions regarding the third season of Dead to Me in great detail. Especially when it comes to Judy's fate. Is she dead, or was the rowboat more of a symbol for Jen to pack it up and move on? I took it as her kind way of saying you should leave now to Jen one Redditor said. She gave the closure and space Jen needs to pack up and leave, then she came back home and continued to enjoy her final days. Dead to me theory says Judy might not die, and Jen might be telling Ben that in the end. Throughout three seasons, Dead to me took a lot of unexpected twists and turns. Most of the time, if you thought the show was going one way, it almost definitely was going the exact opposite. One theory on Reddit says the finale might have taken the same approach. Another thinks Judy died of cancer that day. I think we're supposed to believe that she knew she was going to die from the cancer that day said another Reddit user. That's the impression I got at least. Still, others think Judy took matters into her own hands and rowed herself out to sea to drown herself. It seemed weird to me that Jen would tell Ben the truth about Steve in the middle of the day with her kids in the pool they said in another Reddit thread. The series concludes with Jen saying. Ben, I need to tell you something. Then the credits roll. This show was always big on confession scenes that go in a different direction than you expect. So what if it turned out Judy wasn't actually terminal? This fan thinks Judy could have found out her cancer was in remission, and to avoid arrest, she faked her death. Instead, she's in Mexico resuming treatment, and that's what Jen was going to confess to Ben at the end of the show. The ending of Dead to Me is supposed to be ambiguous, in an interview with Vulture, Cardellini addressed how Judy's story ends. I hate to say what I think it is because I don't want people to believe that's the truth she said. Liz Feldman definitely left it ambiguous on purpose, so I wouldn't want to speak to her creative decisions. Cardellini added. Probably as far as she can remember. So when she goes out on that boat and that is, as she talked about, her happy place she's trying to set Jen free from having to deal with the anguish and grief of what's happening. But you can't really get away from anguish and grief if you love people. This is the final season of Dead to Me. Netflix has no plans to move forward with a season 4.